All right, Jessica, these are pretty horrifying accusations. Yeah, reading through those court documents, just awful. We're talking about 58 year old David Yellen. He's very well known in the gymnastics community, especially with children here at home, but really across the country. And we've come to learn today that he has actually had a lot of contact over the years with dozens of those Larry Nasser victims that we've talked about so much here on Fox 2. Now you mentioned the child porn that he was allegedly in possession of, but also we are learning that he would take photos at the gymnastics facility facility that he worked at of children's feet and then use them for sexual pleasure. I think my first reaction was shock um, and betrayal. She's stunned. Kaylee Lorenz, a survivor of serial child rapist Larry Nasser, learning another well-known figure in the gymnastics community caught with child porn and for using his position as a gymnastics photographer to take photos of kids for his sexual pleasure. I've known David since I was a very, very young when I started gymnastics. Um, he was, you know, always the the guy with the camera around the gym and showing you, you know, what you look like in your skills and taking funny videos of us messing around in the gym. According to federal documents, 58 year old David Yellen admitted to FBI agents he had child porn on his computer, but denied making it. Then agents found he had 1500 images exploiting children, 500 considered child porn, showing girls 10 to 13 years old exposing themselves. Then he told agents he would secretly take photos of children's feet at the local gymnastics academy where he worked and masturbate to them. We were dealing with Larry and we thought that was over and then this comes up and now it just goes back to I think in my head I had trust issues before but holy cow now it's like can I trust anyone that I come into contact with? Kaylee recalls a now eerie message Yellen sent to her the day she testified in the Nasser case in 2018. This is the exact message. Um, I just have to tell you that I am in awe of your strength and courage. I'm so sorry so many people failed you and I promise to do all I can to make our sport better and safer. He's charged for distributing and possessing child porn, given a $10,000 unsecured bond on Monday, meaning he can go home on a GPS tether and have no contact with kids or the internet. Kaylee says she thought he was kind, quiet, and funny. Someone that we thought we, we had as a friend, and um, it, it turned out quite the opposite. Kaylee there continues to be outspoken on this issue in hopes that she can help other survivors. She did compare Yellen to Nasser in that they really acted like they were your best friend. You felt like they were someone that you could trust. Now, in the case of Yellen, allegations at this point, he is out on a $10,000 unsecured bond, so he will be making his way home but be monitored by a GPS tether. Reporting live, Jessica Dupnak, Fox 2 News.